Have you ever dreamed of making your own video game but felt you needed a full team? What if I told you that working alone could actually be your biggest advantage? Most people think game development requires a studio, multiple specialists, years of studies in institutions, or years of experience before you can make something worth playing. But the truth is, many of the best game creators out there started by building games alone. Some important names in the video game history are John Romero, the creator of Doom, Marcus Persson, creator of Minecraft, and Richard Svensson, the creator of Valheim. And they all started their projects alone. Learning to develop games solo in Unreal Engine gives you full creative control, deep technical knowledge, and a portfolio that makes you stand out to recruiters, players, and investors. It opens doors to high-paying jobs, freelance opportunities, and even your own indie studio. Unreal gives you everything you need from AAA quality graphics to cutting-edge tools to turn your ideas into reality. And the best part? If you use the right strategies to show your progress instead of waiting for the final release, you can build a die-hard audience that supports you or get on the radar of headhunters in search for your talent, all during your spare time. In this video, I'll break down four considerations why you should start making games in Unreal by yourself and how it can lead to amazing career opportunities, more visibility, and even a business model. But before we jump in, make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on more Unreal Engine tips, tutorials, free assets, and pro-level game development insights to help you build stunning projects and grow your career in the gaming industry as a high-paid talent and as an independent creator. And if you're serious about becoming a game creator, check out the Game Creator Accelerator where I help beginners with and without a knowledge and more experienced developers to get noticed by following a proven methodology and having my mentorship lifetime access. Yes, lifetime access mentorship. Yeah! Now, let's get started. 1. Why making games alone is the best way to learn. This is about having a full control and a deep understanding. You're going to experience Unreal in the process of creating things that you want to build. And that will give you a deep understanding of the tool. But not only we refer to the C++ part, because sometimes maybe you don't want to be part of the programming or the decoding specialty of Unreal. But you also have to understand the blueprints, the asset management, the AI, so many other areas of Unreal that you haven't considered yet, like special effects, level design, environmental design, or even working with these fantastic high definitions of Quixel that will allow you to create really, really impressive environments and make an immersive experience for your players. Another reason to make your things alone is because you have no dependency on it on a team. And what I mean about this is that you have to make decisions. You don't have to discuss every decision in a committee. Everything that you want to create, you will be able to create it. The downside could be that you don't have all the knowledge, but the fact that you can be proactive and finding the right solutions or the right way to solve your issues is something that will help you develop your own career as an independent creator, but also will define a skill that many are looking for in their own studios. Problem solving and adaptability is a skill you always have to look for it. And keep in mind that if you are in an interview and you mention that one of your most important skills is problem solving and adaptability, you become an asset that any studio wants to have, even if the studio is small or big. Which also takes us to the next consideration, expanding your job opportunities. Being a versatile developer allows you to have a more reach and more capacity of action in any project for any studio. If you are a versatile developer and you have cover because of your own path, creating your own video games, all the areas of the development of that project, imagine what is the potential that you have for a small studio, even a medium studio. Yeah, the big studios will have the uh, specialists in every area. But having an understanding of multiple aspects of the game creation, 
makes you a valuable professional. On the other side, you have the portfolio power. Because you decided what is the kind of game and how long this is going to take you, you can define where you finish something. But it's not only about finished project. It is also about the process of the things that you can do throughout the evolution of your game and your knowledge that others can use in their studios or in their own projects. And keep in mind that also sharing that content with an open audience like YouTube will generate the die-hard fans that can support your independence in the long term. And also for this consideration, keep in mind that you are open opportunities as a freelance. There are many people looking for the talent of great developers or developers that has created a particular genre of video games to be hired to create all their projects. Unreal skills are in demand, and as the time progresses, there will be more demand of this tool. Remember that Unreal is not only about creating video games, but it's also about film, cinematography, architecture, and more. Many game designers and programmers get hired because they showcase self-made projects in Unreal, but also the progress of that project. I can tell you from my own experience that during the first three years of my career in video games, I never found a job opportunity because I didn't share what I was doing. I thought that only because you show your projects in platform, you could make money and you can get into the visual of studios and talent seekers. The reality was that at the moment that I started sharing that in social media and not waiting to finish in my project, my career started to boost. And I found opportunities from independent studio to AAA projects. There is no better way to find a job opportunity than when the job opportunity knocks at your door. And that was the case. Third consideration, why Unreal is the best engine for standing out? First is industrial standard qualities that are getting to a level that is very high compared with previous years. Unreal provides the level of quality that you cannot find in any other engine. And that also includes high quality assets that are in your reach that you can use for your independent projects or also for a AAA budget project. FPS, RPGs, and survival are the type of game that are appealing for a broad audience of gamers. Unreal is the perfect platform to create this type of video games. And you can be intimidated because of the artistic style of the high-level quality of these video games. But believe me, with Unreal, it's an easy process to start doing them. And you're still not considering the cinematography and film experience where many creators are using Unreal to present their ideas of cinematography with a low budget but the high quality standards. From independent studios to Disney, Unreal is the tool we are using. And to finish the point of why Unreal is the best platform to standing out, keep in mind that this attracts recruiters and investors. The high quality of Unreal and the realization of many studios that this is the platform to use in the expansion for the next project makes you an important asset to be collected to their own team. In other platforms like Unity, you can create great games for the mobile industry. But if you want to create the kind of games that I want to create, the AAA games that I wanted to create many years ago, Unreal is the path to go. The question is, what do you want to do? Once you start sharing your progress, job opportunities will start knocking at your door. But also, because you share that on your own social media, let's say YouTube, you will start building a community that supports you for your mid- and long-term future, for your independent business model. Now, if all of this sounds exciting, but you're wondering, how do I actually make this happen? That's exactly why I created the Game Creator Accelerator. The GCA is not just another course online where you get left figuring out things on your own. The GCA is a complete methodology designed to help you first to learn Unreal Engine step by step from your first project to advanced techniques. Second, get one-on-one -on -one mentorship, lifetime access to guidance, Q&A sessions, and online courses tailored to your growth. And third, not only master the technical side of game development, but also learn how to get noticed, whether it's through social media professional networks or by making your project stand out to recruiters and supporters who will leverage your progress to build your independent business model. 
And the best part, it's all designed to be achievable after office hours so you can build your dream career without quitting your job. If you're serious about taking your skills to the next level and getting real results, check out Woolen.com for more information. Or if you prefer, reach out to me directly at Tony at Woolen.com or DM me on my LinkedIn. Now let's go back to the last consideration of why you should make games in Unreal alone, which is building a business model with solo development. Well, the first thing is you own everything, all the revenues, all the things that you created belongs to you. And today you have the possibility of publishing your games on Epic Games, Steam, each IO. You can also define different ways of monetization, not just selling video games, but also you can start developing your project, showing the progress of what you are creating in YouTube and different social media, and generate Kickstarter campaigns to support your progress, or also Patreons and any other source of income that will define what will be your business model in the long term. Keep in mind that to be successful in the gaming industry, it is not just about creating successful video games, but also to share your knowledge, to share what you're capable of, which will expand possibilities for getting a broader audience of other people that are trying to do something similar to yours, but also expand to jobs and opportunities to get an extra income. I always say to my students that in the first term, you should find an opportunity or a job experience in the gaming industry working in a studio. But in the mid to long term, you have to establish your presence in social media to build your independence. That's the best way to confront situations of difficult market conditions or layoff from the industry, which believe me, they will come. To recap, Learning alone makes you more skilled and independent. It creates job opportunities and career options. Unreal helps your game stand out in the industry. And a solo project can be the foundation of your business. If you've been hesitating to start, now's the time. Open Unreal, start building and create something amazing. I'd love to hear from you. Drop a comment and share it. what is stopping you from creating and learning how to make video games. What is your biggest challenge? Do you agree with what I shared? Do you have something to add? If this video brought you value, give it a like, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you never miss out on more Unreal Engine tips, tutorials and career recommendations to boost your game creator path. If you want to take a step further and have uh, me at your side to help you transit this adventure, visit Woodland.com to learn more about the Game Creator Accelerator. Subscribe and let's have a one-on-one -on -one chat. And don't forget to check our video about how to make games without coding in Unreal and continue this adventure. Until next time, keep creating, keep sharing, and most importantly, keep dreaming big. See you soon, my fellow creators.